Delta Airlines has asked the Department of Justice to help create a national no-fly list of people convicted of unruly behavior on an airplane so they can be banned from flying on any commercial airline, Delta CEO Ed Bastian, in a letter to Attorney General Merrick Garland on Thursday, asked for the Doge's support in the much-needed step of a comprehensive list of any person convicted of an on-board disruption. Inclusion on the list should prevent them from commercial air travel, he said. In the letter, a copy of which was provided to USA Today and was first reported on by Reuters, Bastian said such a list will help prevent future incidents and serve as a strong symbol of the consequences of not complying with crew member instructions on commercial aircraft. Delta's request comes as unruly passenger cases spiked after the U.S. introduced a mask mandate on airplanes and in airports on February 1, 2021. That mandate has been extended through March 18. In November, Garland directed U. S. attorneys across the country to swiftly prioritize prosecution of federal crimes that happen on commercial flights amid a historic number of investigations into passenger behavior. The rate of unruly passenger incidents has dropped about 50 percent since record highs in early 2021, according to the Federal Aviation Administration. So far in 2022, the FAA has gotten 323 reports of unruly passengers, 205 of them related to face masks. In September 2021, Flight attendants urged Congress to do more to reduce the number of air rage incidents. Ahead of that hearing, Delta's senior vice president of in-flight service, Kristen Mannion Taylor, sent a memo to flight attendants saying the airline has asked other airlines to share their no-fly lists to further protect employees. A list of banned customers doesn't work as well if that customer can fly with another airline, the memo said. Among recent unruly passenger incidents, last month a man on a Delta Airlines flight from Ireland to New York refused to wear a mask after being asked to do so many times and mooned a flight attendant, according to a federal complaint. The passenger, who also threw an empty beverage can at another passenger, kicked the seat in front of him, and put a fist up close to the flight captain's face, was taken into custody upon arrival and has been charged with the felony of intentionally assaulting and intimidating a member of a flag. Some flights have been recently diverted due to unruly passengers. Two weeks ago, an American Airlines flight from Miami to London returned to the U.S. after a passenger refused to wear a face mask. A day later, a United Airlines flight from New Jersey to Israel turned around after two passengers decided to help themselves to empty business class seats on the half-full flight.